Guys, I'm here in sunny Las Vegas, Nevada, and that behind me is the Stratosphere Tower. And today, I'm gonna to be jumping off it. Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Ultimate Bucket List. And today, I'm in the Stratosphere Tower here in the north part of Las Vegas. The Stratosphere. This famous hotel and casino marks the start of the famous Las Vegas Strip. And it's the one with this massive observation tower. You get great views of the Las Vegas skyline at pretty much any time of the day or night. But that's not what I'm here for. No, 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 you can choose to pay money and jump off it. The attraction is called Sky Jump, and it's basically a controlled descent from the observation deck of the Stratosphere Tower down to ground level. 108 stories high. I must admit, guys, I've done a lot of crazy stuff in my time, but jumping off a 108 story tower, not quite done that yet. You first start off by getting suited up, and they put this harness on you that's a little bit tight. You can barely breathe in it. Um, if you're a gentleman, you'll suffer gentlemanly problems. They make sure you've got nothing in your pockets, you've got laced up shoes, and nothing's gonna fall out 108 stories above the ground. Then they lead you to the elevator, and that whisks you straight up, it takes about a minute or so to whisk you 108 stories high. The most reassuring thing, if you're scared of heights, is the fact that at every stage of the elevator, where they suit you up, right when you get to the door, they check, double check, and triple check everything. So I must have been checked four, five, six times before actually stepping out over the ledge. Now when you do step out over the ledge, that's when you realize that, yeah, it, it's quite high up. Okay, so guys, just about to jump off the Stratosphere Tower. Holy crap, that's a long way down. It doesn't really look like that much from like, if you stand here in the windows, but yeah, this is, uh, this is a long, long, long way down. The staff there are very, very good. They explain everything in pretty much minute detail so that you're not doing anything wrong. When you do step over the ledge, you get a fantastic view of the Las Vegas Strip. But you don't really pay much attention to that because you're too busy wondering what's on the ground level. A big giant bullseye for you to land on. So the person behind you gives you the instructions three, two, one, and jump. And at that point, you have to jump. You can't chicken out at this point. It, it's pretty much too late. In three, two, one, go. Holy cow! When you land, you land on your feet and you then realize, holy crap, I actually did it. Holy cow. There's even a viewing deck down below so that people, friends, family can actually sit and watch you and take pictures on the way down. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah, Woo. Yeah. Hey, these guys have got a front row seat. I don't know if you can see this, but there are people, hey, hey. There are people actually checking me out, which is kind of cool. But guys, what an amazing experience, seriously. I highly recommend that you add this to your bucket list. Definitely if you come to the Stratosphere. Definitely if you're staying in Las Vegas in general. Okay, Nin, I'm sold. What do I do? Well, firstly, you need to come to the Stratosphere. You can book online if you want to, or you can just turn up at the ticket desk and they'll basically issue you a time. With your sky jump, you get free tower admission, so that's great if you want to go up afterwards, take a few pictures, laugh at some other people jumping. And all of this will set you back about anywhere between $125 to $150. Yes, I know it's not pocket change, especially seeing as though the jump lasts less than 30 seconds. But guys, seriously, you're only going to do this once in your life. Pay the money. I'm not kidding. You will have a fantastic time. I. As a vlogger, obviously, needed video, so I paid for the videos. That was an extra $25 or thereabouts. And generally, it could run anywhere up to $165, $166 if you do decide to take the photos and the videos. But definitely worth the money. Is there anything else that you need to know? Well, if you do chicken out at some point, 
I don't believe that there's any refunds, so you, you basically have to jump. What's it like? It wasn't actually that bad. Because they double checked, triple checked, quadruple checked you, and the fact that the harnesses were so tight and the ropes were so tight, you felt that they were in complete control. You weren't free falling. Um, there was no chance of anything going wrong. So I think that's very reassuring. It also takes away some of the danger aspects, which, you know, I, I'm, I'm all for the danger. But in general, you'll feel very safe um, and you'll wish you, you could do it again and again and again because when you jump, it's fantastic, but it's far too short. And obviously that's because the, the tower is only so tall. So guys, definitely, definitely add this to your bucket list. If you have enjoyed this episode, please be sure to like, share and subscribe. Comment on the comment section below. And if you've got any other bucket list ideas, tweet them at me at my Twitter handle. If I get enough suggestions, I will go ahead and do it. But guys, thank you very much for joining me. It's a fantastic experience. You really got to stay here. And we'll see you in the next episode. Uh, not gonna chicken out? Hmm? Not gonna chicken out? No. Either way, you don't get your money back. Yeah, I know that. So, so yeah, I've traveled far too a bigger distance to, to do this today. So, yeah, definitely not chickening out. But guys, you absolutely have to do this. Seriously, Stratosphere Tower, Sky Jump, I'm not kidding.